Hello YouTube, this is Harley here with another episode of Minecraft. On this episode I'm going to show you how to create a cactus farm. But before we get started on that, let's uh, I did a few changes in my house. Not much. I added a bed there because I got tired of going downstairs. But let's go down here and see these new changes. Uh, I made my dog a little, uh, a little bed, I guess you could say. That's just black wool and a few torches and some slabs in front of it. Took a while to get him in there. I had to dig a hole back there to get him to go in. But anyways, I think y'all have seen me extend that. I added another room. You'll see that later. The fireplace from last episode. And I added three more rooms. There's one there, two, and three. They're all the same size. If you walk in, they all have the same uh, type of formation. If you look in the chest, I'm trying to fill them all up like this. Just like if I have people come in the game. They can just grab these. So I thought that'd be cool. Uh, but what I want you to do right now, yeah, these ain't done. What I want you to do right now, I want you to put in the comment section below uh, what color do you want to make each of the carpets of these three rooms. Right now, put one. I don't care what color. As long as it's in the game, don't do something stupid that's not in the game. But uh, put a color on what you want me to make these of. Uh, a floor because I want to make carpet in there and I think that'd be a cool opportunity for y'all to have some input and now I changed my room again because I as I said I didn't like those little um where it met in the corners and it was different stuff but anyways it looks like this now <laughs> uh, I was hoping to look better but if you don't know what this is really it's a uh, Rubik's Cube colors it's the sides of the Rubik's Cube and if you want to pause the video and check and make sure each side is on the opposite of each other, you can. I know the opposite, so anyways. I thought that was kind of cool, and I'll show you that room later. So let's go over to the um, cactus farm. I've already built one. I'm going to meet them together, and this is what you're going to need most likely. You'll need shovels, uh, sand, and cact cacti. I think I said cactus. It's, I think it's cacti. And two buckets of water, but anyways, let's go over here. And there it is, but we're gonna make it bigger and I'll show you what also I did to it. It's really cool. Alright. So we need to uh make like a, a square and it needs to be uh eight blocks wide or long. Like that one, that row right there is eight blocks, so make sure it's eight blocks. Let's kind of square this off a little bit. Got a little extra sand I don't need. And uh, we'll make sure it's eight blocks. All right, so now we'll just go according to this. This is all eight blocks long. So we'll just go according to that. So I don't have to count. All right, like so. Um, I'm gonna take this row out. I don't have a, like a complete, uh, dimensions on to tell you how to do it you just have to kind of go with it I just know it needs to be eight blocks long and you can make it as that way as long as you want but this right here needs to be eight blocks and just keep doing these little columns like so Get out of here thank you all right so that's pretty much it. I'm gonna take these pieces out just because they're gonna distract me on what I'm doing. All right. All right this is where your uh, your dirt. Oh, you also need dirt. This is where your dirt will come into handy. What you want to do is build two things high. It's best if you crouch and do it like this, and you can jump to a new one and then find the block man. like so and add one more over here there we go all right almost done with this portion oh it's getting dark that's okay I got on peacetime mode so <laughs> I didn't get interrupted but kinda sucks it's getting dark 
All right, what we want to do now is take out the bottom row, the bottom one, like like uh, over there. You can kind of tell what I did. All right, last row. There we go. Now we need to lay the uh, cacti down, cactus on the uh, uh, opposite of where these are. See, you want them opposite. So I can't put any on the back row just because it won't uh, fall into water. So we have to do it just like this. Um, let's go ahead and make a bed and let's just go to sleep because just because I don't want to work in nighttime. Alright, now this is where your water is going to come into play. Uh, you can make an infinite water source right here or something, but I'm just going to use it out of there because it's not that far away. And we just want to take the water and make it run down. Uh, the columns toward uh, that away just because we have our blocks back here blocking it off and we're gonna need a few more buckets two buckets are is would be uh, the best one to have all right if you notice it stops right there it's because it's eight blocks long and water runs eight blocks now what you want to do is dig another trench this away I uh, should I need that to be eight blocks that might be too long and we want water to flow that away like so all right perfect now uh, I have it flowing to this other system that I've already made and I have it meeting in the middle and then flowing th that away and it goes down into that hole I'll show you where that leads to in a little bit but if you don't want to do make it that complicated you could just make a little trench right here and uh, just a little trench, a little pool of water right there or whatever, and you can just hop in and collect them. Uh, the most I've ever collected is like 18. I think the most you can collect is uh, 20, I believe, or 40, I mean. So just a little hidden tip. Now let's, uh, let's go to, uh, take a ride down this and see where it leads to, and I'll show you that. See, if you notice, every time it gets to eight blocks, there's a drop off. That's just the way I have it set up. Yeah, this took a lot of mining. You don't have to do this, but I wanted to lead into, I'll show you in a second. See that every eight blocks is a drop off. Let's make this a little faster. And then, I'll block that off. Look. Climb the stairs. And uh, voila. It leads to my uh, house. This is what the extra room is right now. It's not really a room. It's kind of like a tunnel. So the tunnel leads to the cactus place. <laughs> so it's pretty much it. Um, I lost. I messed that up. But oh well. I had a block there so it comes out of this hole and I can just grab it pretty cool what I want to do right now is uh, make a, actually make a chest down here and a furnace I actually have chests upstairs I could use but oh well and what what this is gonna be is just like an area for the cactus cacti whatever and then I can uh, torch it in there I don't have any charcoal uh, coal to do that but anyways, guys, that's how I did it. Um, you don't have to make it run to your house like that. I just wanted to be a little different. I thought it'd be kind of cool. Let me put this back up. So yeah, it's pretty much it. It's not that hard, but it's 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 interesting to do. And uh, I know a lot of people don't have cactus in their cacti. Crap! I don't know what to say. <laughs> they don't have it in their world, so that kind of sucks. But just uh, find a seed generator that does have it in uh, that world. So, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll talk to y'all later.